What's up, Internet? This is Rambling Josh, and you're watching another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Today, we assault Bavel in an attempt to finally, finally get Yuna back. That's a big city, and it looks kind of like an airship, or something. And that's a pretty freaky hat. That's a big tower. a pretty funky wedding dress. Isn't there like some law against marrying dead people? Uh, I guess they have fireflies instead of fireworks? I guess they're prepared for me. Machina? I thought Yevon was supposed to be all... Machina are evil. But it looks like they have Machina guards. I don't think you're gonna do a whole lot against the airship with those little guns. Quickly, let's run up the stairs and then stand still here instead. Okay, now those guns might do something. What? They're like... Surfing down the chain? There's no way! I mean, it's cool, but... It's completely impossible. I mean, I guess you have to kind of expect these kind of things in video games. They're not the most realistic things ever to begin with, but still. Let's see here. I don't think there's anything back here. But we should make our way through these guys. Oh, uh, my party's kind of ailing. Uh, first things first, get the Brotherhood back on. And let's use an L-Bed potion. These guys aren't too hard. Um, these guys in the red, you can use a flamethrower attack, so I'll you know, take them out first. The guys with the rifles, as you can see, not all that threatening. Alright, let's use another potion just for posterity. Yeah, sure. I swear I've gotten better at doing that again. Doing Tease's overdrives. I just seem to fail whenever I'm actually recording now. And more soldiers. Ah, but here we have another new enemy, a YKT-63. Um, 
it can do some special stuff. Uh, I don't think it's a particularly special enemy on its own. Um, although it can, if it's the last enemy uh, in the group, it'll do a thrust kick, which will eject a party member from battle, I believe. But we can also learn thrust kick. Flamethrower. So yeah, you... Come on. Ah. Uh, you probably want to kill the robot dude first. It's got a little bit more health than the soldiers, but I mean, 4,000 isn't much at all. Lots of soldiers up this. You don't want to talk to me? I guess you're just standing there to prevent me from going down the side. So... Can't go down either side. Gotcha. Up the stairs then. Here we do have another new enemy, the YAT-99. Uh, you can't hit him with normal melee attacks by default, because it's behind these guys. So, yeah. Can I steal from him? No. Uh, you might want to make a habit of stealing from these warrior monks. Okay, that's a bad example, but you can uh, steal purifying salts from them, which are... I think at least that uh, they're somewhat rare items. Uh, let's get Lulu back in here to kill this guy from a range. And for some reason he's weak to fire and water, but not lightning. Okay, whatever. I'm not quite sure uh, why, but Tiasis seems to be getting his overdrive meter filled up pretty significantly at the start of every battle. So, I mean, he should be able to use an overdrive pretty much every fight. Oh. Uh, can't kill that thing from the energy rain. Okay. Let's see here, just as, oh, okay, never mind. Auto scene. Destroying your plan since whenever the first automatically scripted scene was. This has gone far enough. Stop. Their guns are pathetic. Why are we stopping? I guess everything does lethal damage in a cutscene. Everything except for falling from exceptionally high heights. Has she really been holding that behind her back this whole time? Why do their guns have like fins on them? You would play at marriage just for a chance to send me? Your Apparently, resolve yeah. is admirable. All the more fitting to be my lovely wife. She just wanted to wear the pretty dress. <laughs> Stop! Do you not value your friends' lives? Are you threatening me? 
your actions determine their fate. Protect them, or throw them away. The choice is yours. That's not a very nice thing to do, old man. Bouncy stick. You are wise. It's easy to say when you uh, were the one whose life was in danger. Yeah, I know you just tried to kill me, but give me some sugar. Who exactly is applauding? It seems like everyone here is either, you know, one of the good guys or a soldier. Kill them. <gasps> what? You can't do that. I am sorry, but it is for Yevon. Aren't those weapons forbidden by Yevon? There are exceptions. This gun is kind of shaky. Throw down your weapons. Let them go. Or else. Our presence here has done a fine job complicating the situation, it seems. Leave now, please. You're coming with us! Don't worry, go! This is foolish. If you fall, you'll die. Yeah, that's kind of the point. <laughs> Don't worry. I can fly. Um. Believe. Yuna can fly? When did this development occur? So she's just gonna jump, anyways. Why? Now we, there's no, like, bargaining chip. They let us go anyways, so why is she jumping? It's like, they just had this idea that Yuna should jump and it will, it'll be dramatic. Oh, Veiled Fork. I guess that's one way to do it. But wouldn't landing on Veil Force still be like high impact or whatever? Cover your eyes. Oh hey, she's yelled to cover your eyes. Maybe we should stare directly into the thing that she's throwing. What what was that? An all dead flash bomb! Let me go! I'm gonna kill that Seymour! Yuna said leave. We leave. We'll join up with her later. Break through! Ah! Ah! Where'd Yuni go? The Bell Palace is temple. Yuna goes to one place only. The Chamber of the Faith! Oh, so there's a Chamber of the Faith here. That's convenient.
It's too quiet. A trap? Who cares? Yuna's waiting for us! Huh? What's um, a doing in the something tells me playing with the control panel isn't a good idea. I suppose it comes in handy. That's not what I mean! The teachings! What about the teachings? Hey, don't look at me! I think it's become fairly clear by now that no one cares about the teachings. What's this? Oh, well that's what the control panel does. That's even niftier than Another machina? your average escalator. So this is Yevon's true face. They betray their own teachings. <sighs> They treated us like dirt. Or Waka. But will we ever actually, really, for real, get Yuna back in our party? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Catch you later.